The Broadcasting Corporation are making a major move over in the Turks and Caicos Islands. The BCB and Digicel today renewed a contract allowing Zadnas to join the TCI TV lineup. Tonight, Devante Hanna has the details from the signing and the road ahead as Zadnas readies itself for the region. By putting pen to paper, residents in the Turks and Caicos Islands will continue to enjoy watching the ZNS network. The contract for renewal signed today in Providentiality Turks and Caicos by executives from both companies. CEO of Digicel TCI Addison Stoddard and manager Calvert Robertson say paying to have ZNS on their cable lineup for Turks Islanders just makes good business sense. ZNS, of course, has, you know, great cover, not just news, of course, sports. In fact, I find myself when sometimes the Olympic comes around, I, I sometimes tune, out, I tune into ZNS and, of course, listen to the commentary because, of course, you know, you have um, really excellent coverage and we, we have our Caribbean athletes that are well covered there. So um, this is really a great initiative and I'm happy that this has continued. And, and of course, we'd like to see it grow further. Listening to the conversation just now, um, it brought to mind... Uh, a, a text message that I received this week from one of our agents. They sent me a message and said a customer specifically asks if their package has ZNS. All right? And that's one of the reasons why they wanted the package. So I said, yes, it's, not, no, it's, it's available. And also, it, so it goes to show the, um, the relationship that ZNS and Digicel um, will have and continue to develop for years to come. ZNS General Manager Clint Watson is of the view that this partnership with Digicel is a win for both territories. ZNS, who is uh, the leader in, in communications in the Bahamas, partnering with Digicel, which is a leader in the region uh, in, in communications, it makes sense. And this is what we need to do more of in the Caribbean. Uh, Caribbean giants in their various perspectives partnering together to ensure that the people of the region are connected and have great opportunity and options to choose in great television. We are creating great television in the Broadcasting Corporation of the Bahamas. Not only are we going to be a leader in the region in news and information, but we're going to be a leader in the region in great entertainment, great entertainment, great shows, uh, great uh, documentaries, and of course, our leading platform now in digital media. And Deputy General Manager of Family Island Affairs, Darren Meadows, believes the agreement will pave the way for new TCI talent. So you, you, you could rest assured mm -hmm. that, that we will begin the process of engaging the local producers so that we have shows that come from here. I'm talking about your athletes, your culture, your politics, your religion, and so forth and so. Um, in doing that, we would like for Digicel to partner with us uh, and make things happen in that regard. Chairman of the Broadcasting Corporation of the Bahamas, Picewell Forbes, says the Bahamas and TCI has a lot in common. He likened it to one big family sharing cultural, religious, political, and civic similarities. And recently at the corporation, we would have gone through an exercise where we would have had the relaunching and the rebranding at the Broadcasting Corporation of the Bahamas, ZNS Radio on television. I mean, we have some 18 new programs, and we should be in full effect come April of this year. So we are on exciting things are happening at the BCB and we are glad that to be here once again to sign in um, Providentialis so that what we are doing in New Providence could also be seen here. BCB executives say they plan to further dialogue with Digicel to ensure it can put ZNS in homes throughout the region. For the Bombs tonight, I'm Devon. Hello everyone, I'm Fern Carey. Thank you for watching our YouTube page. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe for all things ZNS.